you talk about? So my presentation today was really a, was really about using um, invasive, using the tools that we have available to us, whether they be maps or or iPhone apps or or you know just online resources websites to help make early detection and rapid response easier and more accessible to the average citizen. I really liked one part in your presentation where they said they saw the bird, they called the guy, and then they got in there very quickly, and right. that's that's very important. Right. When, a, a, especially when you're going up against animals and not just birds. Right. I mean, it was it was really a great example of how it's supposed to work. Something was reported, and within two hours, you know, the bird was, you know, from here to you know maybe one of those trees down there from the guy that saw it it was hanging out there you know they were able to come in and and remove the bird very quickly and uh, and it was a species that was of enough concern it was worth dealing with very quickly and, and they hadn't actually seen one it, it had been months or even longer since they had seen a bird so it was it was um, a good example of how things are supposed to work now this is a very interesting question I'm going to ask you, what is your favorite invasive or the one you find most interesting? Because I know all invasives are bad. I think from my perspective for, um, you know, the, um, the Nile Monitor lizards that they have in, in South Florida now, I think are really interesting. Um, they're, they're very similar to the Komodo dragon in that kind of, uh, in that family um, of, of reptiles. And so, you know, to me, where the large snakes are scary and, you know, everything else, um, you know, the, the, the Nile Monitor lizard, something about the six foot long lizard crawling around just kind of freaks me out. So, um, is it hurting the other lizard population? Yeah, and it, and, it, and it eats, it preys on alligator eggs and other birds. So, it, you know, it's a, it's a major problem, but, um, but yeah, I, I think that the most interesting one, maybe not my favorite, but the most interesting one is the is the Nile Monitor. I think the most overlooked invasive species is the uh, feral hogs. Because feral oh, hogs, you know, have a, have a great impact uh, on the environment, and and they're sometimes just overlooked because of hunting or because of other issues. You know, um, some people like them because for hunting purposes, but they they really um, can be devastating to the environment.